Hello there, this is a small virtual more tutorial about how to create a stock, stockable variants for the same product. How does this work? We're using Virtuemart 2.6.2, the latest uh, Virtuemart compatible with uh, Joomla 2.5. First off, I'm going to delete some products. We're going to start by explaining the case. It's an iPhone 5 flip case, it's an iPhone flip case for the 5, 6 and 4 and it's going to be uh, in several colors and I want to have a stockable variant of all those colors. How do we do this? Well, first off we have to go to custom fields. Sorry that this is Dutch but it's basically it's always the same in uh, other languages. Uh, I already created it. It's a plugin and I'm calling it variants. Well, how does it look? It is a card attribute and the plugin is called Custom Stockable Variants. When you first make this, these fields are empty and you can basically up to four items create four variants for a product. Color and size are now in here. It's red, green, blue, black, purple, etc. and for three sets of iPhones. That's what I already did. Basically it's creating this field and then the custom attribute is there. You go to your article. Then you go to special fields and I'm going to create a new variant. Well, here it is. I already had one so I can delete this. The unique code is going to be the same as this one. It's i5 flip. I'm going to create, basically, for Virtumart, this is creating a new product that's a child product related to the parent product, the article name. It's going to be uh, iPhone flip case, no extra costs, and I have 10 reds, first I have to put in 10, because I cannot change it later, and when it's here, I just press new. It should come up now. It doesn't. Why not? There you go. Again, then I'm going to delete this. Create a new variant. Article code is I from flip case. Article name is iPhone flip case. No extra cost and it's 10 in supply. Four red. You see red, 10 in supply. Creating a new one is exactly the same. Unique code is flip case. Article name is iPhone flip case. And this is a green one. I could put in green here, I'm not going to. I have uh, 50 greens in supply. I first have to put in the supply. And after I put in the supply, I can change it to green. The same I'm going to do with the unique code like iPhone again. Flip case. iPhone flip case. And this is going to be the the black. That's all I have. I've got uh, 20 blacks. I add them. I select black. And now I have three. It's a bit messy layout, depending on your virtual mart, I guess, or your translation file. Sometimes it's shown easier. But this is basically how it works. I've got red iPhone 4, 10 in supply. Green iPhone 4, 15 supply, and black. 20 in supply. Having done that, I'm going to store the article. And close it. And what I'm going to see now is quite... Uh, it's going to explain how it's done. I have made three sub-articles that are shown here. It's iPhone flip case, iPhone 4 or 5 flip case as the parent article. That's this one. And it has three sub-articles. If I'm going to go into the parent article, I'm going to view this. I now have options. 
I can select red, green, black for life on four. And that's exactly how I need it. And when ordering, the stock is being reduced for the child product that I created here. So it's a very easy way to create stockable variants in Virtual.